I try to really lean into it. I can see it all popping right there. Sure, you can see it working. So you know he's activating those fibers right there. Too many people, their goal is just to move the weight, you know, which means nothing if you're not hitting the belt. on this, like I said. It's all... I, you, I feel that pre-workout. Really <laughs> you feel it, right? Oh my god. You're gonna feel it. I know it's... I'm down, I'm down a meal today, too, so I know it's gotta be that. Yeah. That's it. Right Six. There. One. See, if you do an exercise right like that, you can tell that they're, they're hitting a certain body part. You, know, you don't even know anything about lifting weights. You just see it. Four. Five. That's it. Yeah. It's all in a contraction. When you use a muscle, coming up to the top, you're contracting that muscle, whether you're swinging it slightly, but if you contract that muscle at the top, squeeze that muscle, you're going to get that muscle to grow. Do that movement, all focus on the medial head. It's right here, you can see it grow. Actually, you can see a muscle that you're working because it heats up and he's sweating just in that area. <laughs> no, that happened on our ride over here. I was sweating thinking of you. <laughs> what, was gonna what was gonna happen to me? <laughs> so, you know, you can, I'm just gonna go even lighter on this. You go lighter on yeah, this just, 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 just so I can get a little more motion. See, Still working, you can see it work. Yeah. Hey Rich, what's the difference between uh, using dumbbell laterals compared to cable laterals? Uh, it's just a variety in the movement. When you use a dumbbell lateral, I, I just it's it's a it's my preference. Cable, it could be constant tension. Use it as a finishing exercise as opposed to like a growing exercise. You see we're doing them kind of at the end. Um, so that's why I'm doing them. I'm doing them now. That's the difference. I'm gonna go a little heavier. We're gonna go to 40s. Lean, lean. Yeah. That's it. I'm warmed up. Rich Gaspari, top 10 ever in human history. I'm here now. Damn <laughs> I used to compare myself to him when Eight. I was, we were both 19, you know? Nine. My days of delusion. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Get it. Ah. One more. There's a lot of teenage greats, and I was, you know, good as a teenager with some other greats and like, uh... You know, back, back when we were teenagers, Remember teenage shows? A hundred competitors. Yeah. Not as many today. That's it. Grind it up. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. That's it. Ten. Cables being shaping versus free weights being size. You think that's nonsense? Or that was a question asked. I think that you know cables can get more of those lines or cause more of the definition that you get in your delts because it's constant tension. Can you grow off cables? I think you can. I like changing it around. Feel that pre workout. Oh my god. He's using the new, the new secret Super Pump 250. And he's on plasma jet right now. Well, he's on everything now. He's all gets buried out. Plasma jet, super pump, uh, glycofuse, and, uh, and amino acids. I'm telling you, it's real. It's real. <laughs> you feel it? Oh, yeah. I do. I'd rather get the reps here. Good. Let's do it. Lean. That's it. Hit that.
that tail. Eat that tail. Good. Good. Um, though I always pre-exhaust my delts, I do always pre-exhaust them with pressing movement. Always finishing with a, you know, always do either regular machine press. Uh, I did the Scott press today. Uh, I'll pre-exhaust because, uh, you know, a press will work all the side delts, the side, the front. You work everything in it. And then I'll go to like a, a, a specialized exercise, like a lateral. We're going to go to the next exercise. Um, we're going to do a wide grid up cable upright row. Just going to change it.